Hello, hello everybody and welcome back to Doorways. So, I'm a bit stuck again, cause I'm not sure what to do. I'm looking for something to cook with, and I can't seem to find it. But again, I'm gonna do what I do best, which is to stumble around like a moron, and my luck will find something. I'm sure of it. Actually, you know what? Let me go back to that room because I could- I remember I could open the door from the other side of that generator room. And I mean, I don't know what's that gonna accomplish. Maybe it'll open a door to the magical world of Narnia or something, but other than that- Oh wait, hold on. No, never mind. It's in the darkness, so that's not a good idea. Uh, uh wait. Can I actually- hold on. Let me try this something. Oh, I can, but why? I, uh, uh... Oh, what is this? Oh, I'm reading it? Okay. Addressee Juan Torres, during our last conversation, you talked about some overheating problems with the emergency generator of the school. You will find the ingredients for an experimental coolant we are working on and the load sent with this note. This solution should be at least 20 times more effective than water. Unfortunately, the current solution is too volatile for transportation. This is why it must be prepared near the place of use. You will find the cooking instructions attached to this note. We will be waiting for results. Yours sincerely, blank. Coolant AB101. Ingredients to prepare 1 liter. 600 milliliters agents 0 31. 200 milliliters insulating oil 21 C. 200 milliliters nanoconductor 0 AD. Instructions Take the agent 0 31 and apply 100 degrees of heat during some seconds until the solution turns from transparent blue to strong blue. Then add 24 C and finally 0 AD at the indicated measures. Note. 24C and 0AD produce a special chemical reaction and in turn yellowish when mixed together. 0AD is an unstable substance which oxidizes quickly in touch with the air, losing effectiveness and turning violet in every few seconds. Well, okay. So, chemistry time, I think. So that's where we're supposed to cook the thing. Uh, Alright. So yeah, we're progressing, in a sense. Well, not just yet, because we still have to cook the stuff, and, you know, we have to play a little chemistry. But, where is the stuff that I need to mix the stuff in the thing, in the, with the thing, and on the other thing? I'm assuming, wait, are, are the drums, are those drums the chemical stuff that I need? Oh, I think it could be, hold on, let me place this. Why do I keep pressing that? I need to press items. Items. Oh, hang on! <laughs> cook the knife! That might be just the stupidest idea I've ever had. Yep. <laughs> I I was gonna kind of try it if I started out this, near the stove, but you know what? Now I actually know what to do. So, okay, I need something blue. Blue item. Oh, okay. Blue item. Are you blue? You're not blue. Dump it. Dump dump the item, because... Yeah. No, no, dump, dump, dump it. There you go. Okay. Because that's not blue. How about... The second one. Are you blue? You're not blue either, so you're gone. I, I need... Escape. Bl I need blue. Dump it. I wish the system was a little faster, but, you know, it's not a huge complaint or anything. How about you? And behind door number three, we have blue! Okay, so I need... So, hang on. Uh, Mr. Blank Sender, you only gave me 500 milliliters of crap. So, I'm assuming I need to half that, what you just said in the instructions. So, 300 should do it, I think. Uh, okay, so cook it. Cook the thing. For a few seconds. Is that gonna work? Uh, okay, it turned to s Oh, hang on, I think I was supposed to- Oh, oh, I- I messed up, hold on. I know- Yeah, I know what to do, I think. Hang on, hang on. So I need to put that and make sure it's only for a few seconds until it's transparent. If I do it anymore, it's gonna turn black again. And I'm assuming it's not gonna be that good. So okay, cook it. And now, stop. I, 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 I don't know if that worked, but okay. 
So, what about this? Is that gonna work? And maybe this? I don't know. Did that do anything? I don't know. I don't know what those. If those were the right items, saying, "Are is it the right item?" Uh, okay. You picked it up, so I'm assuming it's right. Let's try it. I, I, I don't know. Did my luck actually work in mixing this compound, whatever? And I'm assuming once we put that, the lights are gonna be back on, and Scorpio Demon Asshole is gonna be disappear forever. And if that happens, I'll be very happy, because he is being on my dick really, really hard. Uh, and I keep doing that thing. I don't know why. I don't know why I keep doing that. Here, have your little coolant. Did, did that do it? Did that work? It might have, because it's not smoking anymore. And if it's not smoking, I'm assuming that's a good thing. So here. Now, work. I think you're working! Yay! Kinda. Hallway is still dark. Don't like that. But hang on, I'm gonna go back the other way anyways. And like I said previously, if there's something good after pulling a switch, there's always also something bad. And I think... Yay! Something good happened! Now what awaits me as the something bad part? Well, the demon plants aren't gone, so that kind of sucks. But it, that's not the bad part, I'm assuming. But now I can s explore the school at whim because... No more darkness. So, I kind of want to explore all the places that I haven't been able to explore before, but... I don't know if that's going to do anything. To be honest, all the doors that I've unlocked... Yeah, that was the door that went into the generator room. Uh... Oh, it's the theater again. And I couldn't... Do I want to go to the exit? Let's see. Um, I'm assuming that, yeah, this key opened that door. And now it's light here, so that's good. Uh, wait, what? Oh, no, no, don't do that. Hey. Oh, come on. I wanted to explore the school, you douche Oh, okay. Well, there's a note here, so... Are you reading it? A concentrated oh, yeah. and toxic smell had taken over the place. I could observe Hieronimo, how his unblinking shiny eyes were following the movement of the silhouettes. Every student was either locked up, unable to move, or both. The school had turned into his refuge. This was a slaughterhouse, a gift from father to son. I reached for the light switch. The bulbs turned on. Reflections of blood started to flicker. Tens of kids were revealed, hanging upside down like animals, their skin torn off. Some limbs twisted, other parts missing. So why are you watching this and not doing anything about it and writing this? Instead of writing this, maybe you should save them. They were his classmates, reduced as objects. Things he used to play with, skinning, cutting, and tearing off their skin. Each scream of pain and each plea fascinated him. They were toys, desperately begging for the forgiveness of a mind rotted by hate. No one could ever know how truly regretful they had been. No one could have foreseen that death could be something they longed for. Hey, buddy, here's an idea. Take a gun, shoot Hranimo in the face, so this I wouldn't have to be here doing this. Going down to the darkness is the thing that I'm talking about. I mean, I just turned the lights back on. I don't want to go down to the darkness. I really don't. It's not a good idea. We've been through this before, character. Haven't we? Things got quiet. Things got really quiet. That's really not good. And holy shit, what is this? A CIA bunker? Holy sh look how this deep this thing goes. Uh Julieta? Is that you? The chalkboard has been looking for you. You might want to go over there and move out of my way. Oh. Or is it a Ranimo? 
please, how about somebody shoot him in the face so he could stop putting body parts in front of me. Oh. Hey, so sounds are getting... Seriously, how deep does this thing go? Who the hell builds a school this deep? And who the hell builds a bone pit in a school like this? Did you kill the entire village? Or the town? Or the city? In this place? Look at this shit. Oh, look at this shit. It's like a mass grave. Okay. Oh, I need to use a key probably. Uh. Hey, I'm gonna keep you handy. Because I think... You're gonna be something important, Master Key. So, Master Key opened the doorway to my death, probably. Why am I moving so fast? Oh, I'm moving faster now. I guess that's good. And this hallway kind of spell spells out a chase scene if I ever saw one. I feel like something's coming up, and it's not gonna be good. Yep, get ready for a chase, guys. Oh, oh, now it'll be time to run. Time to run. Yep, buddy, come on, come on. Come on, hang on, hang on. No, no, not, not escape. Not escape. Open the, open the thing. Cause you're not gonna interact with it if I have a key, apparently. Cause that's the thing. Uh, uh, okay. Door. Uh, oh. Hey, that's not, that's not helping. That's really not helping. This is, well, and that's not helping either. Uh, so could you stop screaming? I would really appreciate it if you would stop screaming. Cause it's not helping the situation at hand. So stop that, please. Uh, key. I need a key. I need a key. Open it. Uh, okay, step in the light. I see the light, and it's good. Oh. <laughs> Act 1 finished. Thanks for playing the early access. The current version ends here. Updates are coming soon. Oh, that's cool. So that was only Act 1, guys, I guess. I didn't know that. I didn't know there was supposed to be an Act 2 for this. Um, but it was definitely good. I liked it. Um, I like the graphics, the, you know, the aspect of don't go into the darkness and turn the lights on and make sure there's light. It, it, it was kind of a nice puzzle aspect to that one. And, yeah, I liked it. I definitely did. And I will finish, I will definitely play Act 2 when it comes out. And the atmosphere was great. Like, the enemies, the demonic plants, they were kind of cool. <laughs> but I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I hope you guys really liked the game as well as I did. Um... Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!